On this Learning with Lindsay, we're going to dive into why debris was found so far away from the tornado that hit Linwood, Kansas last May. That tornado was rated an EF4 that got with winds up to 170 miles per hour and at one time was one mile wide. That is a large area for debris to get lofted up into the cloud. And because this storm was particularly strong, the debris got really high up in the storm. Here is a cross section. This is what the cloud looks like from the inside. The base of the cloud where the tornado is located has a lot of blues and greens. That is the debris, but we can follow the path of the debris all the way up to 50,000 feet. And to put this into perspective, airplanes fly at 30,000 feet. So debris is getting lofted so high up in the cloud and in the sky that the jet stream starts to take this debris farther and farther away. This is why the debris from the storm was found 30 to even 50 miles away from Linwood, Kansas as the crow flies. So as the storm travels across the river into the Northland, we are noticing this debris falling out of the storm, falling out of the sky. And we get pictures like these from Mark Mundell in Smithville. He's got shots of styrofoam, of bamboo, paper, and even some plant products from a nursery in Linwood, Kansas. What makes this so amazing is that the storm was so strong that it allowed this debris to fall very far away from that storm in Linwood.